Hello, yes, patience, determination, and the right message. That's right. That's all we need to win. And I've got plenty of that in abundance. I'm just finalizing now the new leaflet that's gonna be going out in Kensington very, very shortly. It will address and uh, cover the problems, issues, and tragedies now facing the forgotten and beleaguered white working class of Kensington. And I expect to get a good uh, response from this leaflet. And I will continue working and campaigning in Kensington right up until May 2019 when the next county council elections are. You see, like I've said before, and I'll say again, the present day approach and policies from Liverpool City Council and the three sitting Labour councils cannot fix Kensington. Remember, they're responsible for wrecking it, not Joe Owens, they are. And if they pass the book to central government, then at the very, very least they've remained silent and complicit in the wrecking of Kensington, haven't they? Of course they have. And here's one example to show you what's actually happening in Kensington. On the alley gates in the um, side of the entries in Kensington, there's eight or nine different signs now with, in different languages that have been plastered on the alley gates. Now, that's basically telling you who's dumping the rubbish because if it was local uh, people that live in Kensington community, they'd just have one sign in English, wouldn't they? But they've let the cat out the bag here, haven't they, by putting eight other different languages on there, because that's basically telling you who's dumping the rubbish. So what's Liverpool City Council going to do about it? Put more signs up in the hope they'll go, yeah, OK, which isn't happening. The rubbish is continually still being dumped. What are the three sitting Labour councillors going to say, going to do? Are they going to speak out and say, well, it's the third world is dumping the rubbish here, so I think we need to stop dumping any more in the area. But they're not going to say or do that. You know they're not. Joe Owens will. Like I've said before, vote for a man who can bite as well as bark. OK, thank you.